Welcome back to Brandon Sports Talk. In today's episode, I'm going to be talking about should the U.S. women's national team, soccer team, get paid equal to the U.S. men's national soccer team. I think personally that the U.S. women's national team should get paid equal to the U.S. men's national team because I think that the U.S. women's national team should definitely get paid differently than obviously the U.S. men's national team because for one the U.S. women's national team has more wins than the U.S. men's national team does and obviously they have been in contenders for more World Cups and FIFA World Championships than the U.S. men's national team have because obviously the U.S. women's national team has been in nine nine times to the World Cup and have won eight times and have six Olympic medals on the U.S. women's national team versus the men's national team they only have two Olympic medals and they've only been four times to the appearance title appearance so when you do that the US women's national team definitely has more qualifications and recognition than the US men's national team so that right there tells you that the US women's national team should get the recognition and the money that they deserve and obviously get paid more than what they do just not just because obviously gender equity but because they are the outstanding team and have more accomplishments in that and also if you look at it this way when you look at household names the US women's national team has more household names like Alex Morgan, Casey Murphy, Carly Lloyd and other players like that versus the men's national team they only have maybe two reckonable names which is Aaron Aaron Long and Clint Clint D Dempsey those two players are the only recognized names that people may know on the US men's national team versus if you look at the women's national team most of the people that are on the US women's national team are reckon household names because they play also in the NWSL which that gives them coverage and then once you see the NWSL players go to the national team you're like oh they that's where I know them from and with that I think obviously the US women's national team should definitely get paid equally and obviously get what they deserve because they are the ones that truly has put the US soccer on the map. If it wasn't for the US national team, USA soccer would not be on the map to where it is now. And that's all thanks to obviously Carly Lloyd, Alex Morgan, Megan Ripley and that's all thanks to those three and more. Thank you for listening to Brandon Sport Talk on should the US women's national soccer team get paid equally to the men's USA national team. See you in the next episode. Bye!